This little mammal is a scavenger. Called Didelphodon, she is a marsupial and specializes in raiding abandoned dinosaur nests. This evening, she could be in luck. Unfortunately, the smell of the nest blinds her senses to danger. period and the continents are taking on their modern forms but this ceaseless movement of the earth's crust has also produced a surge in volcanic activity across the globe massive eruptions that have lasted for centuries have laid waste to landscapes and filled the atmosphere with poisonous gases and debris this desolate world is still ruled by dinosaurs, as it has been for 160 million years, but they are nearing the end of their reign. Life on Earth is choking to death. Yet in the last two million years, the dinosaur's most infamous predator has appeared. Tyrannosaurus a five-ton, 13-meter-long carnivore, specifically evolved to kill other giant dinosaurs. This is a male, and he's been drawn to the foot of this volcano by the smell of food. The area is full of geothermal springs, and the air is thick with sulfurous fumes. But there is another smell mixed in here. In one small valley, there is the stench of death. Unwittingly, the Tyrannosaurus has been drawn into a natural trap. Volcanic vents here are producing poisonous carbon monoxide, and because it is heavier than air, it has formed a suffocating layer close to the ground. The giant predator stands above the layer, but as he puts his head down to feed on one of the corpses, he begins to feel the effects of the gas himself. If he topples over now, he will never get up. Eventually, his sheer size is his salvation. As he stands up with his prize, his head just clears the gas layer. <laughs> <laughs> 